In this video, I'm going to teach you how to use Stable Diffusion on GitHub. It's a very quick and easy process, so make sure to follow along. First, download the Stable Diffusion GitHub repository and the latest checkpoint. Once you have downloaded the code from GitHub, you need to run Anaconda aka Miniconda3 to run the code. I'm not going to show you on this video or teach you how to run codes, but it's a very quick and easy process and I recommend you look it up on Google if you need help running the code from GitHub. After you open up Miniconda 3, you will see this window if you set up your Stable Diffusion's files properly. After you locate your files within the folder, just drag and drop the Stable Diffusion main folder you downloaded from GitHub into the folder you created for Stable Diffusion. Afterwards, you need to go back to Miniconda 3 and use the following commands in the Miniconda 3 window. Wait for all the files to be downloaded and extracted, and after everything is done, you can go back to your folder and copy and paste the checkpoint file you got from GitHub into that folder. Afterwards, if you downloaded and extracted all of the packages properly by using Miniconda 3, you can open it up again and find where you installed the Stable Diffusion code from GitHub by typing conda activate ldm. This will allow you to now type a prompt and wait for the images to be generated on that same folder you installed Stable Diffusion on. I hope I was able to help you on how to use Stable Diffusion on GitHub. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more quick and easy tips. Thank you for watching.